But he was pierced for our transgressions, he was crushed for our iniquities, the punishment that brought us peace was on him, and by his wounds we are healed. He himself bore our sins in his body on the cross, so that we might die to sins and live for righteousness, by his wounds, you have been healed. He heals the brokenhearted and binds up their wounds. Come to me, all you who are weary and burdened, and I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon you and learn from me, for I am gentle and humble in heart, and you will find rest for your souls. For my yoke is easy and my burden is light. But he said to me, My grace is sufficient for you, for my power is made perfect in weakness. Therefore I will boast all the more gladly about my weaknesses, so that Christ's power may rest on me. That is why, for Christ's sake, I delight in weaknesses, in insults, in hardships, in persecutions, in difficulties. For when I am weak, then I am strong. But I will restore you to health and heal your wounds, declares the Lord, because you are called an outcast, Zion for whom no one cares. The Lord is close to the brokenhearted and saves those who are crushed in spirit. The Spirit of the Lord is on me because he has anointed me to proclaim good news to the poor. He has sent me to proclaim freedom for the prisoners and recovery of sight for the blind, to set the oppressed free, to proclaim the year of the Lord's favor. He will wipe every tear from their eyes. There will be no more death or mourning or crying or pain, for the old order of things has passed away. Lord my God, I called to you for help, and you healed me. On hearing this, Jesus said, It is not the healthy who need a doctor, but the sick. He said, If you listen carefully to the Lord your God and do what is right in his eyes, if you pay attention to his commands and keep all his decrees, I will not bring on you any of the diseases I brought on the Egyptians, for I am the Lord, who heals you.